Okay, let's go over the chicken wing stretch. Now the chicken wing is just a funny name to help you remember how to do it. But what we're going to do is we're going to take one hand, we're going to reach behind the back, and we're going to grab with the other hand. And so as we're grabbing, you see in this case I'm grabbing with my left hand and I'm going to pull my left arm out so that it's a chicken wing on this side. Now in this position, I'm going to take my, my neck straight down. We're going to take it down and we're going to roll it to the left and then we're also going to roll it back over to the right. And as we're rolling it, we're going to get a stretch deep in the neck, especially on the opposite side of the chicken wing. So this side of the neck is the side of the neck that we're getting the most profound part of this stretch done on. So again, we take the arm, we reach it behind the back, we grab with the other arm, we chicken wing, here it is right here, and then we drop the neck, and then we roll the head all the way over to the left, and all the way over back down to the other side. So this is a repetitive motion we're going to do about 10 rotations to each side. Now we're going to take the other side, grab, and we're going to chicken wing this arm out, and we're going to do the same thing. We're going to drop the head down, and we're going to roll the head over, left, and then back again to the right, and then back again. Again, 10 rotations is what we're looking for. This is a good functional stretch. It's an active stretch, meaning you're using your muscles at the same time that we're stretching them, and that's an important element to keeping a nice lumbar spine.